part is that you can go on trails and have fun and we can roam and explore with with our family and it's fun just to see all the animals and plants. It was such a beautiful day we decided to take the kids out instead of having them just be indoors and they love coming here because of the nature and it's uh, nice for the grown-ups too because of the shade. It's fun to get away from normal parks. Here you could adventure around and we would pretend that this area is like a big jungle and then over there is the desert and then the gardens or prairies and so we would just walk around the whole world. The UCR Botanic Gardens are a 40 acre nature preserve. It's a great place for children to come and visit. We have children's classes and children's events. Our goal for our 50th anniversary this year is to raise $50,000 to get the children's fund started. We're hoping to have a children's garden where children can, can learn to garden. We're also hoping to have a, an outdoor classroom area. We are certainly planning to have some extra restrooms. It's a way of getting them out into the gardens and nature. And to do that, we have to have financial support. To be a part of the initial developing of a children's garden, I think is quite special. It's about giving to something that is going to give children education. Isn't that cool? <laughs> yeah, it's cool, huh? You can see how much potential there is for this garden. And with a little funding and tender loving care, it could be so much more than what it is. Please uh, continue to donate in the future. We've done a great many things in the past with your donations and we'll continue to make the UCR Botanic Gardens a rewarding experience for the Inland Empire. Our kids have been coming here since they're babies and they just feel like that this is just their backyard. Donating to these type of funds really helps generations to come to really enjoy and see the environment is something beautiful and something that we need to take care of.